Okay, starting our somewhat uh, abbreviated walk around of this 2003 Salt Shaker 300 series. This boat's always been kept on a lift, always well taken care of. As you can see, very, very clean boat. side. It's in all respects looks like a new boat as we go along. The superstructure extremely large. Got ice and glass enclosures fully. There's a curtain on the back that uh, comes back to make kind of a total ex uh, enclosure on the aft end of the boat. We'll put that up later on and take some pictures of it. Right now it's just kind of sitting there. side of the lift is really hard to get to so I'm going to guess that the other side is as nice as this one as you can see no thing scratches nothing to talk about in terms of uh, wear and tear it looks very very good I got a close-up of the superstructure here for diving, swimming, cruising, what have you. Could probably make an interesting dive boat, even a charter boat. Looking at the rooftop, there we go. And I'm just going to put the camera down into the forward cockpit area. There is a cuddy cabin on it, which we'll get to in a bit. As you can see, very spacious bench seats both sides, gunnel compartments, then turning around and looking forward from the hatch for the cuddy cabin. Very big, sturdy bowsprit, anchor, large cleats, coated railings. Radar. Very, very beefy looking hardware on the boat. Basically a custom built boat. A brief tour of the Cuddy cabin for you. Everything is very, very clean as you can see going forward. Rod holders on both sides. There's a uh, head underneath the Veedworth. Then looking back toward the companionway, two lockers, light fixtures. Just a short step out to the main cockpit area. You'll have to excuse the cinematography on this one. Um, this curtain is kind of dividing the boat in half, but we'll get the curtain up in a little bit, and you can see the whole effect of the console and everything. These are the seats, pedestal seats. In excellent condition. Homing pads, all the upholstery looks really, really wonderful on this boat. And it's just been replaced. I'm going down toward the transom. some engine shots in a little bit. Just turning around now, looking from the transom back. This big curtain, we'll get that up pretty soon. Tackle box underneath the uh, captain's and co-pilot seats, under gunnel rod storage and cleats, live wells, lots of storage space on this boat, gunnel compartments, spotlights, See everything is really top notch on this boat. Nice big aft cockpit. A lot of space for a 30 foot boat, including the cuddy cabin. The short clip of the engines. Yeah, 225 four strokes.
of the rear cover here. Let me get the boat up a little bit higher. Near the, the okay, we'll get the full rear cover on the little video. Wraps all the way around, connects to the... There we go. 